Hey guys, in this video I am going to show you how you can remove the smoke from the background. So for this example we have a, a white smoke and if I change the color, as you can see this is a totally transparent image. If I turn off the solid color and show you the smoke with the image, as you can see this is totally transparent and you can place it anywhere you want. Let's see how you can do it. First duplicate the image, then go to the adjustment layer and labels. For this step, we just want to make the smoke a little bit more whiter. If your smoke is um, dark color, uh, just make it a little bit dark. So I will make it a little bit white like this. This would be fine. Don't do it too much. Then select that duplicate layer and the adjustment layer and merge them. Then press Ctrl A to select the entire image. For example, on my situation, the smoke is on the entire image. If it's not the case, uh, you can just select the smoke part like this. That would be just fine. Uh, for this example, I will just press Ctrl I to select the entire image and copy it. Ctrl C to copy. Then create a solid color, whatever color smoke you want. So for example, if I want white color smoke, I will create a solid color with white. If you want a dark smoke, you will create a black solid color. Then select the mask and holding down the alt key click on the mask then go to edit and paste that will paste your copied smoke effect you can press ctrl d to deselect and holding down the alt key click on the mask again our smoke masking is done now create a solid color whatever color you want then put it bottom of the smoke layer and as you can see this is totally transparent if we change the color as you can see that's totally transparent uh, smoke and if you want to change the smoke color just double click on the solid color and you can make it dark smoke so let's show you and even if you want you can put it on the uh, other image or something like that other place you want to use so let's put a background over here i'll put the background behind the smoke as you can see, smoke is totally transparent. That's how you can create a transparent smoke in Photoshop. If this video is helpful for you, give it a thumbs up. If you have any question, ask me in the comment section. I'll see you soon on the next video.